So I had filmed an entire introduction for you guys. It's been a solid year since I've made my last video. Well, last video consistently. And what I realized was that this mic is on backwards. But the good thing is, since it's pointed towards me, you could probably hear me really well. This is episode three of the game day barbell vlog on my channel. So a few new developments in my life, I'm sure you guys have noticed. The first being, I got a new car. No longer the Sign FRS. We're rocking the uh, Ram 1500 Rebel. <sighs> and uh, as you can see, I'm basically the glorified errand boy of game day. And to not make this video so long, what is Game Day Barbell? Game Day Barbell is a Parrelton gym that I'm opening up with Nico, Tim, and Joe Stanek. Uh, my endeavors to become a physician are going to be a place of hold, as well as my competitive endeavors in powerlifting. Man, it is hot! But, um, you know, this has been my goal for quite some time. We're in beautiful Austin, Texas, um, and it's great being your own boss, having uh, business partners that respect you and we coordinate really well with each other. Howdy, partner. You do know how long I've been waiting for you, right? Uh, I'm sorry, I was just you, walking you, out. You, you've been gone for three hours. It was. I told you to go get the ladder, I, and I don't see a ladder. I, I forgot. They could wait. Yes, sir. I can't. I love you. <laughs> we coordinate really well with each other. And uh, that's basically the gist of what I've been doing for the last year, guys. It's been a long time planning game day barbell. I'm super excited to show you guys the finished product. Give us two to three months and we'll have it completely ready, fully decked out, powerlifting gym, six combo racks, plethora of powerlifting equipment that you could, just the things of your dreams. So, um, it's super close to the airport, five to 10 minutes, um, right in the heart of Austin. Um, and you guys can see the gym being built from step one until the finished product. the uh, temporary 100 and GDN subs warehouse. We're gonna go ahead and create a partition wall right up here and then use this in the future uh, as just a warehouse for both getting a barbell, nutrition, and 100. Tim's trying to take me out and take my third ownership. <sighs> Fucking hate this dude. God. So thick. And uh, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. I was, I was saying that uh, like the boards, the, the rock sheets look really thick. <laughs> Day one orders done. <laughs> it's so hot in here. So Thick. The like drywall the over there is looking thick. Yeah. Not you. <laughs> it's closing time. Na, 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 na. Uh, I, I'm not. Andrew, get the fuck out of my shot! <laughs> I scared myself, dude. We actually treat them like that. What the fuck? I was so confused. So, so, so tense. All right, we're done for today. And now, I'll see you guys at Liberation. Oh. What the <laughs> now, of course, our first option would be to lift that game day barbell, but right now, with the condition of the building and our lack of equipment, it's just not really possible. So we're visiting these gyms, Liberation, Lift ATX, Gym One, all fantastic gyms in the Austin area. Uh, getting a lot of inspiration from these guys, uh, chatting with their members, their owners, uh, getting some feedback on how to create our own gym. It's just a great community. Um, Austin has been so hospitable to us, but 
yes, we're working out of these gyms. Um, no, we don't intend to stay at these gyms permanently, but they are or have been uh, excellent temporary gyms and great hosts so far. See if I can actually hit this. Wait, are you serious? Dude, after the warehousing today, hell yeah. I'm fucking exhausted.